pie. Today I'm going to be talking about the dimension of 3D glasses. I just got this. They have this dongle. By the way, they are the wired glasses. Here is the packaging. A book. Software. And again, the glasses. Right. Now, I've heard a lot of reviews about these glasses that they either suck or they're, they're awesome. And uh, I haven't installed them yet and I'm going to find out. For this I have two computers and two monitors. Okay, the first computer is this Core 2 Duo. It has an NVIDIA 8600. Now, and uh, it will go with this LCD monitor, 19 inch, uh, the usual. Okay, and this is the second computer. This is the good old Pentium 4 with hyper threading and NVIDIA 6600. And this is going to go with this 15 year old uh, monitor and it has a maximum refresh rate of I think 75 Hz. Now, because of driver issues and because of general compatibility, I'm going to test it on both and see if it works on either one. Now, Will it suck? Will it be good? We will just have to find out. I will come back later. Yes, they do work. This is several days later, actually. Several days later. Because I was so caught up in playing Half-Life. Half-Life 1. With 3D graphics, it looks 10 times better than Half-Life 2. I know it's hard to believe, but like, uh, you walk and you have like uh, objects pop out of the screen and everything is 3D as if someone neatly modeled everything out of paper you know it's amazing uh, I know it's impossible to show this on camera this is how it looks on the screen right you see two guns and uh, yeah and you see everything is doubled like sort of double vision uh, and in the glasses of course you won't be able to see the actual 3D effects but just to get an idea how this works right in the first uh, goggle, one second. Okay, here. Yeah. Right, you can see the gun is here. Right, the image is normal, it's not doubling anymore. And uh, you get this perspective. And in the second goggle, you see the gun is here. And the, again, the image is okay. Right, in actuality, the image isn't so jerky as you see here. This is just because of the camera. Right. And if you watch here, let's right, see, gun here, right, gun here, and inside the brain it combines it so that, well, the gun is doubled in the game, but uh, the entrance uh, over here, it's actually with you, you can see it, it's like a model and it's the monsters are behind the entrance. There's nothing like watching Barney pop out of the screen and offer to buy your beer, I'm telling you, nothing like that. Oh, by the way. And this screen doesn't work, uh, even though it dimensional claims that it should work, but that's in theory, right? It's supposed to be, the, the requirements are a minimum of 75 Hz refresh rate, right? But LCD monitors offer a maximum of 60, and those that say that they offer 75, the final 12 Hz are like, sort of doubled, they are not real um, refresh rates, it's more of copies, so it it actually spoils the even image even more. So on this monitor I was able to get zero to the effect. But here I'm telling you, it's nothing like it. Even on this monitor, I would prefer playing Half-Life ten times more on this monitor than in two dimensions on that one. It's that simple, I know. You've got to see it because with this it's impossible almost to describe it. By the way, so this is, I tried it on the first computer which is the core to do with NVIDIA 8600 and uh, the standard dimensional drivers. Right, uh, I don't know about Half-Life 2. In my next video I will be attempting to play, well, I'm, I'm going to do, be doing something anyway, because uh, I might buy a larger monitor with uh, a refresh rate of um, about 100 Hz, because on this monitor there is some flickering when you are playing. Aye, but that flickering, um, it's not like if the refresh rate is lower, it hurts your eyes. Because it's sort of like uh, watching an old uh, 
movie from like the 1930s where it's like um, an old projector or something that's the closest I can describe it. So it doesn't really hurt the eyes. I've been playing for several days and uh, I would expect that with the dub, uh, half and the refresh rate because if I want to get sharper you should like them. Um, your eyes should be like bleeding already but uh, sorry the video stopped for, the, for a second there. So what I was saying that uh, you would expect the refresh rate uh, to really hurt your eyes, but it doesn't hurt. It, well, they are slightly more tired than this monitor, well that's natural, but uh, it's, uh, since it's actually like sunglasses, uh <coughs> excuse me, it doesn't really, it kind of counterbalances this effect. And I just assume with the monitor that can support 100 girls, this one supports a maximum of 75, and it doesn't even look like it's 75. Uh, yeah, uh, it's, uh, how do I say it, uh, it's acceptable, so the only, I can only recommend that you try it because it's awesome. Okay, until my next video, ciao. Sorry, the video stopped for, the, for a second there. So what I was saying that uh, you would expect the refresh rate uh, to really hurt your eyes, but it doesn't hurt. It, well, they are slightly more tired than this monitor, well that's natural, but uh, it's, uh, it seems it's actually like sunglasses, uh <coughs> excuse me, it doesn't really, it kind of counterbalances this effect. And I'd assume with the monitor that can support 100 girls, this one supports a maximum of 75. And it doesn't even look like it's 75. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, how do I say it, uh, it's acceptable. So the only, I can only recommend that you try it because it's awesome. Okay, until my next video, ciao!